Welcome to the third gen workshop, everyone. If you like our videos, please take a moment and hit that subscribe button. In today's video, as part of our trailer project uh, series, we are installing a Hallmaster Steel trailer tongue storage box that we purchased from Harbor Freight, along with a pair of LED lights. One of these lights we mounted inside of the box to shine uh, you know, inside at night, and the other will be on the installed on the back of the box to shine down on the trailer deck for when we install the winch. Let's get to it. Today we're going to install a trailer tongue box. Um, I got this from eTrailer. Uh, it's a, a Hallmaster 35 inch steel. Um, I wanted something that would fit on top of my steel deck and be able to hold my car straps and things like that. Now, for those of you who watched the trailer prep video, I have already pre-drilled the holes to mount this on both sides. Um, I used one of the factory holes and not the other because I didn't like where um, they were lining up to the structural steel on my trailer. I've also pre-drilled a couple holes for wiring and an accessory light that I'm going to put inside of here um, to light this thing up. Uh, at night when you're trying to get into it. The um, box came with U-bolts um, to um, be installed and then they came with these plates. I didn't like the U-bolts again because of where they landed on the um, on the frame so I, I converted to U-bolts from U-bolts and I went just with st standard nuts and washers uh, and bolts and we're going to lock this down in place. I will be putting Loctite on these bolts um, to make sure this doesn't come loose um, from vibrations stuff like that. right side or the left side of the trailer technically of the box is fully installed this thing is secure not going to go anywhere um, the next thing we're going to do is get my lights on both sides mounted the lights for the storage box are installed that should provide plenty of light inside and then I have one on the other side uh, to provide light down on the deck, especially for you know the winch and things like that. Um, I'll wire them up as part of the um, auxiliary lighting video that I'm going to be building. Um, but that's it. Sport storage box install complete. Thank you for watching. If you like these videos, please hit that subscribe button. In the next video in this series, we'll be mounting our auxiliary LED lights uh, across the trailer deck, the tongue, the front, and the rear, installing a controller switch panel uh, in order to segment those lights and turn them on as we need, and then running all of the wires uh, for those auxiliary lights. Stay tuned, more to come.